Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to solve the unable to delete your folder bug. It's in Windows 7. Now I have a folder here that I'm trying to delete and I keep getting this error when I delete it. This is no longer located in, then it gives you the path. Uh, if I click try again, nothing happens. So now we're gonna figure out how to fix it. Now, first things first, before you do this, you could just try and restart your computer. If it was stuck for any reason, restarting the computer could lead it to disappear and then you wouldn't have to do this. Alternatively, you could uh, just hit F5, which is the refresh button in Windows. That should refresh the folder and maybe it will also delete that way. Now, if neither of these work, then the next step is to open the command prompt. You can do by going to the search button and typing CMD. So now that you're in the command prompt, you need to navigate to the path where the folder is located. To navigate to different paths, you have to use the change directory command, which is CD. First of all, let me see what's in the C directory. To see that, I just type DIR. So this shows me all the folders that are in the C directory. Then to navigate to, let's say, example, the user directory, I type cd users and now i'm in use the users directory so now i'm just going to go ahead and navigate to the path where the file is located okay so now i'm at the path where the file is located i know that because if i type dir i can see the file that i'm trying to delete so i'm going to try and delete the file right now using the del command So this failed because it only took the first word, remember? And I have a file name with spaces in it. So for file names with spaces in it, you have to use quotes. So let's do this again. And it failed again. Uh, but the reason is I was using the DEL command which is the command to delete a file, but I'm supposed to use the remove directory command because I'm deleting a folder, not a file. So rm, so that command is rm dir. Still failing, huh? Okay, we tried deleting it in the GUI, that didn't work. We tried refreshing, we tried restarting, and we tried deleting it in the command prompt using the remove directory command. So let's now try using the MS-DOS 8.3 name and see if we can delete it that way. To do that, you type dir backslash x. And so now you see the MS-DOS 8.3 name next to the file name. Let's see if we can delete it that way. So remove directory. And it looks like that worked. DIR. The file is no longer there. We come back to the GUI. The file is no longer there. And so that's how you delete a file in Windows 7 that has the bug unable to delete because the path could not be found.